Question 20. Seb has some cubes with a cross on each face and some cubes with a circle on each face, like in the picture here. He sticks five cubes together to make this shape. What have we got to do? It says, how many crosses and how many circles are there on the outside of the shape? Now, this one is all about trying to visualize what we are actually going to be able to see. So let's take the number of crosses first. Well, the crosses are going to be on this cube and this cube. But there's going to be more crosses on the outside of shape than the ones we can actually see. Because there's going to be some on the other side as well, around the back, that we can't see. So if we take this cube first, well, we can see one cross. But there's going to be one on the bottom of this cube, one on the left of this cube, and then another one around the back of this cube. So there's actually three more that we can't see plus this extra one. So the three that we can't see plus this extra one is making four. So there's four crosses just for that cube. On this cube, we've got one on the top, one on the front, and one on the right. But there's another one that we can't see just around the back there. The one underneath the cube we're not going to be able to see because it's going to be covered by these this cube with the circles. The one on the left hand side we're not going to be able to see because it's going to be covered by the cube with these circles. So we've got the three we can see plus this extra one around the back. So that makes four again. So in total the number of crosses we can see is four from this cube and four from this cube. So on the outside of the shape, there's going to be 4 plus 4, which makes 8. So there's going to be 8 crosses on the outside of the shape. Now for the circles. A little bit harder because we've got three cubes to think about. Well, on this cube, on the top here, we've got 1, 2, 3 that we can see. Then we've got a fourth one round the back there. And we've got a fifth one round the side here. The only one we can't see is on the bottom of here because that's going to be covered by the cube with the crosses. So this cube is going to contain five circles that we can see. The cube around the middle, we've got one on the top. The second one we can see there, we've got one around the back there. We've got one, another one around the bottom there. So that's one, two, third one around the back, and fourth one underneath. So that's going to be four right up there and this cube here we've got one that we can see second one that we can see one round the back here one round the left hand side there so that's four and then one underneath so that makes five so it's going to be one two three four five the only one we can't see is the one that's hidden going to be hidden by this cube with the crosses so that cube's got five so we've got five from this top cube, four from the cube in the middle, and another five from the cube at the bottom. So five plus five plus four is 14. So that's how many circles will be on the outside of the shape.